These are the Lady Knights from the rural mountains of Fujian, China. Their region is renowned for its abundant tea production, predominantly grown on the winding roads of the mountains. Their daily lives revolve around tea picking, and their livelihood depends on the tea they cultivate. This beautiful area has nurtured many traditional cultures and unique customs. In this captivating place, the tea-picking women create a picturesque scene. They ride motorcycles, skillfully maneuvering through the tea gardens, adding a sense of dynamism and vitality to the land. The tea plantations are located at an altitude of approximately 800 meters, covering a vast area of over a thousand mu. The plantations employ 80 female tea pickers who diligently harvest tea for a month. The daily tea yield totals 4,000 caddies, with an average of 50 caddies per person. When viewed from above, the tea-picking women seamlessly blend with the lush green tea trees, creating an especially delightful sight. Some large tea gardens hire a significant number of female workers to pluck fresh tea leaves. They reside and dine on the mountains, staying away from home for several days until the autumn tea harvest is complete. Most of these women come from nearby towns. Each person harvests 50 caddies of fresh leaves per day. Once they arrive at the tea gardens, the tea pickers promptly assume their positions and begin their work. The ideal time for tea picking is from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m., during which the tea picking women rarely take breaks. Every day, they traverse the winding roads, transporting tea leaves. They have honed their driving skills and have become adept motorcyclists. Due to this, internet users have bestowed upon them the nickname Lady Knights. These roads are not ones that an ordinary person dares to drive on, making these women truly remarkable. Only they truly understand the hardships they endure due to the treacherous mountain roads. Based on the different harvest times throughout the day, tea leaves can be categorized as early green, midday green, and late green, with midday green being of the highest quality. Harvesting midday green leaves is crucial for producing premium grade tea. To facilitate the collection of more midday green leaves, the tea plantations send lunch up to the mountains. The tea pickers have their meals on the tea mountains. They always carry large water bottles when they go out to work. Once they finish harvesting in one tea garden, they either walk or ride motorcycles to another tea garden while carrying the tea bags and tools. The diligent work of the tea picking women contributes to the prosperity of the tea industry in Fujian. Their work is not merely a tradition but also a continuation of a way of life. Through tea picking, they convey the abundance and beauty of this land to more people. The incorporation of motorcycles in their work has made it more efficient and convenient, enhancing the efficiency of tea picking. Fresh tea leaves, under normal temperature conditions, gradually release moisture, causing the leaves to wilt. The color changes from bright green to dark green. The enzymes in the fresh leaves are deactivated through high temperature treatment, and some of the moisture is removed to make the leaves soft. By rolling and twisting, the size of the tea leaves is reduced, shaping them into strips or round shapes, defining the appearance of the tea. Through shaking, fermentation, and semi-fermentation, the leaves rotate and rub against each other. This final process aims to remove excess moisture and compress the tea strips, allowing the tea leaves to fully dry for storage.